if you have an iphone that is unavailable due to too many passcode attempts then at last you don't have any option to enter the passcode only erase or restore is the final solution if you want to save your data then some glitch makes the iphone unavailable to enter passcode mode try this once this video is in the description below or on the i icon you can check it if your iphone is disabled and connected to wi-fi or cellular data is enabled then you can see the erase iphone option from here you can erase your iphone without pc by entering the apple id passcode if this option is not showing or cellular data is used then you can restore or erase your iPhone with PC. If you face this, then how you can fix this with PC or without PC? First, you have to download the firmware. The first way to download is that processor from iTunes. You can download it. Go to website. Choose category. I'm here choosing iPhone. Choose the desired model. Choose the latest signed firmware. Wait for a few minutes. Downloading depends on your internet speed. This tool itself direct access to the firmware you can download it from here too. If you download it from here, then you don't need to import the firmware. It will automatically detect the desired model firmware. If your iPhone is disabled or unavailable, then the PC can't detect your iPhone. So you have to choose a different mod. You have two options. One is recovery mod. Power of your iPhone. This process supports iPhone 8 to all models. Press the power key and insert the data cable connected to the PC. Then wait for some time. Then you saw the recovery option on the PC screen. This is the Trio tool. Here I am using. Let's go to the another mod. The another mod is DFU mod. This is blank screen mod. Press volume plus, then volume minus, then power button. Till the mobile is powered up. Then press volume plus, then hold volume minus and power for 6 to 10 seconds. Then release the power button. Keep holding volume minus till the DFU mode shows on the PC screen. If you download from other side, then you have to import the firmware. Now you can import firmware from here if you have an auto download source. Click on import and give the file directions. Here you can see different options. This one is flash with data. In that case, not helpful. The iPhone on available remain the same. You go to second option, quick flash mode. This option erases all data of your iPhone and reset to factory mode. Click on flash. This may take 10 to 16 minutes to complete. Remember, internet is not to be disconnected and PCs should not be shut down during the process. This may damage your iPhone.
After a few minutes, the update process is complete. The iPhone is restarted and the second time bar is running. Wait for to finish. Now you are in the hello screen. Follow the activation process. That's it for today. Thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. And don't forget to give your feedback. It's me, Host Akash. Peace out. Now fully updated iPhone is in your hand.